Good evening everyone, this is Adrian from the Game Guiders. We have come to the next, to the last mission of uh, Hitman Contracts already. Damn, this is going fast, I'd say. This is Lee Hong Assassination and it's actually uh, almost a, a copy of um, that mission from... Um, oh my god, Hitman Codename 47, in mission 4, yeah. Uh, but uh, there is still... Um, the map isn't very... it's not very similar and it's another way to do it but the objectives are the same and contracts is all about him remembering what he did uh, in the previous uh, his previous missions so yeah that's why right the first thing we are going to do is to take out this guard now you can sedate him but the thing is that we have to take out two guards in this way of doing it so I rather kill this one than the last one because uh, in case he wakes up so I'm gonna of course take the micro UC for my collection and his clothes and you have to be careful here, the guards are very suspicious, so run until you... Well, I, I know how far I can run, but if you do not know that, just walk past them, to be sure. But you can run for a while, and then you have to walk the last bit. And this is the slowest elevator in Hitman, and that says a lot, because there is at least hundreds of those in uh, the Hitman series. So I actually speed it up the time. <laughs> uh, yeah, so... Basically, this is there's no timing here. Uh, I you, all my missions are on timing almost, but this isn't except from the first guard. Uh, so um, you can just take your time. You don't have to run like I do, but yeah, I I, I did it sometimes before I figured it out. So that's why. <clears throat> now we are coming to a point where you have to choose uh, either if you are uh, want to restart it every time to get the right one, Thank or you, you just want to figure out the other ones. I'm I doing uh, the me. safe where I that is hidden at the Lee Hong's office, but it can also be in you the arms depot and uh, in the oh brothel. Now, chair? I choose to do the Lee Hong uh, the office because that's absolutely the quickest, as you I see. Yep, it. it's the Lee Hong's office. Now it's um, the other ones are not Hong's any office. harder, uh, it just takes a, a bit longer time. So I chose to do this since it's the quickest and uh, easier for you guys to... Uh, yeah, so you don't have to wait for an eternity because I choose one that takes five minutes longer. So basically what you have to do is you have to do the same thing that I do. I go to kill, go up and kill uh, the Lee Hong. Because he has the safe combination on him. Maybe there is another way to get the safe combination as it is in Hitman Code 47. I'm not sure because i always done it like this. So... Uh, be happy to post uh, uh, tips if you have any any comments on this uh, would be appreciated all right so now we are just moving uh, as far away from the guards as we can now these are easy but well they're all easy if you just walk past them but th this can make your heart jump a bit because they're so close but you can just walk right past them like that and here is the bodyguard of Li Hong. Uh, do I, I kind of trick him to, to end his um, patrol by running a bit. So he like hears me and starts following me. Or not following me, but like he goes back to his room now. And I've done this mission a lot of times to figure it out. And I've never ever noticed that he comes out again. So uh, maybe he does, but uh, you have enough time to at least do what you have to do here before he comes out. So... I'm now going. I'm going to show you where he goes in. You see that door to the left there. Uh, yeah, in there he goes, and the door is closing. And here is the guard, the second guard we are going to take out. And now, of course, we're going to use the sed that sedative, so we only have one kill in this rating. And uh, don't uh, be alarmed by the red flickering. It's just because he was uh, very close to you. All right, and it lags a bit here, but I hope you can live with it. It sometimes happens. I don't know. I didn't have that problem before, but. I'm gonna figure it out anyway. So, uh, we don't have to pick up anything from him, just, we just have to remove him. And you see here is Lee Hong. And I take a big, like, half circle around him, because if you get too close, he has a sword with poison on. And one hit, and it will kill you. So, I go out, just to go in again, just to be sure that it doesn't look behind his back. And then we kill him. And we take up the safe combination, and here's the safe with the jade figurine. This, this is why this is the, that's why this is the fastest way of doing it. And you see, uh, the bodyguard is still in his room, so he haven't moved out. So, yeah, I don't think he will ever go out again. All right, we are actually done. <clears throat> so now you can just go to the exit, 
and uh, you can run here no no guards uh, but there is a guard down here on the right so don't run here and mission accomplished not all zero but still uh, a pretty decent rating I hope you agree at least silent assassin and a bonus weapon so I'm very happy that you uh, joined me for this uh, video I hope you will subscribe if you like what you see and that you will join me on mission 12 very soon that's the last one bye bye